What's going on guys? Cursive Man here uh, to do another video. I got an awesome uh, package in the mail from a buddy of uh, mine on here, Gary. Um, he's a YouTube friend and a Facebook friend and just honestly an all out nice guy. He's, uh, um, you know, we've talked back and forth about Thor and other things and, and uh, he's just a super great guy and I, I honestly recommend uh, Y'all, I, I definitely want y'all to subscribe to this guy. He's starting to do comment book haul videos now, so um, he's got two out there, and uh, he's got some pretty awesome figurines that he's been showing. And um, he's a Thor guy too, so hey, you got gotta love that. And he likes Galactus, which is uh, another one of my favorite characters. So um, he uh, saw my video where I, I was trying to get all the old Thors and whatnot, and he just contacted me out of the blue and. Uh, just out of pure kindness said hey I have one uh, I'd like to send to you and um, uh, next thing I know it's in the mail plus some extra stuff he sent to me so uh, Gary I really appreciate this man I, um, I know a few things that you like so I'm gonna try to send uh, return the favor and shoot you something too in the mail so um, anyways let's get to what he sent me with I don't have the package right here with me but uh, it was a nice bubble wrap you know awesome package uh, Every, everything I've gotten through YouTube has been very well uh, packaged. Everybody uh, seems like all us guys here in the YouTube community, comic book community anyways, know how to uh, properly package comics, so that's a good thing. Um, I've ordered stuff off eBay where they're not packaged right, and, you know, it kind of upsets you when there's, you know, comic books sitting in a package without boards or backers or anything like that, so um, packaged very well. Um, anyways, here, let's get to it. Um, he, he said he was sending me the Thor thing, and I didn't, you know, that's all I thought I was getting. That's all, I mean, I was just gracious enough to get that. It was awesome, but he threw in a couple extra things, which was very awesome. Um, a couple of Silver Age Avenger books. Uh, the first one is, um, it's, uh, King Size Special Avengers number two. Um, I think Larry's pretty rough on me. I'm sorry. Um. The cover is freaking awesome. It says uh, the new Avengers versus the old Avengers. It's really cool. It's got all you know different uh, characters on there. Of course, Thor's on the cover, so that's awesome. Um, yeah, this is really cool book. I can't wait to read this. Um, second one was another Avengers book, and it's a really older Silver Age book. Um, Avengers issue number forty-three. Uh, here he is, the Red Guardian. Gosh, sorry. <laughs> um, that is a really cool cover there. Looks like it's got Hercules and uh, the, uh, I'm not sure what, I forget his name now. The um, Hawkeye. Hawkeye on here. I got my little co-host here in the corner. He's my, uh, my uh, Wikipedia off to the side that you don't never see. Adam Gamer, so, <laughs> Adam Gamer 27, if you haven't subscribed to him, hook him up, he does game videos, and and now his big thing right now is Minecraft, so uh, he's, he's all about that, but anyways, back to the comic book, um, issue 43 of the Avengers, the Red Guardian, is a very cool looking cover, um, you know, I, I was really excited to see these, it's got Scarlet Witch on there, and Quicksilver, and, um, that is really cool, um, and then the one he said he was gonna he has showed this in a video, his very first comic call video, which like I said, I want y'all to subscribe to him and check it out. Um, this was a uh, Journey into Mystery with Thor issue 116. Um, it's uh, the Trial of the Gods. It's uh, not read this, I've read a, a little bit about it, but um it's a very cool book. Uh, super excited to have this. You know, I'm, my journey into mystery collection has gotten I don't know, I'm not going to say it's big, I got like four issues or something, which that's pretty good, because, you know, there's not a whole lot of Journey into Mysteries with Thor, so i um, pretty excited about that, but, um, yeah, like I said, Gary, thank you so much for the package, I, I really do appreciate it, and I'm going to try to return the favor, and hopefully I can send you something cool that you sent me, so, uh, um, thanks again. Um, I was also going to show... Uh, my comic haul for this week plus uh, I got a couple things on eBay so um, I figured I'd go ahead and show that stuff 
Uh, first off, I got this week, I picked up uh, Animal, Animal Man Annual Number 1. Uh, I'm sure all of you got this. I read it today. It's a very good book. Uh, the story is really cool. Finally get to see Swamp Thing in the, um, in the issue, so that, that was really cool. To, we finally got him in there, so hopefully he'll be in issue 10 when it comes out next week. Or whenever it comes out. But anyways, Animal Man Annual Number 1. Uh, we got Batman Annual Number 1. Um... Featuring Mr. Freeze. Like I said before, I'm not a huge Batman fan. I'm just getting into him, so uh, didn't know a whole lot about the uh, enemies and that type of stuff with these characters. But um, I was really intrigued by Mr. Freeze's character. It's almost like he's he's a bad guy just because of sadness. You know, he um, well according to the story, I don't know if they changed it or not, but uh, I kind of felt bad for him. You know, he, I, I really didn't want to be against him, you know, I, I felt felt terrible for the guy, but, um, anyways, uh, talks about the Night of the Owls and stuff like that in it too, so, very awesome artwork, really good book, um, definitely recommend those two, and I uh, also picked up, uh, Walking Dead number 98, I just jumped on this bandwagon here not too long ago, uh, I think, uh, <clears throat> um, couple guys I've seen on here has just gotten into this also. I've had a few trade paperbacks and stuff, but I wanted the actual issues. So I got 97 was my first, so now I got <clears throat> 97, 98. Read this today. Really good. Um, his books are pretty graphic. They, they're definitely a, a mature audience, I would say. So, um, But the story is really cool. I'm excited to see how this issue 100 turns out. So... Walking Dead 98. Um, <clears throat> I picked this one up. I think I showed it in my last haul. So Epicule number one, or it might have been the haul before. I picked this up. It's a variant cover. I just thought it was pretty awesome. Uh, it kind of reminds me of like the Kill Bill uh, suit, except it didn't have all this cut out in it. But hey, that's cool too. Um, it's uh, the story was cool to me. I liked it. It's you know typical. Uh, assassin type story so I'm excited to see what the uh, rest of the, the next four turn out to be so uh, that's just second print different color uh, Epicule um, also I picked up uh, I saw a thing on the YouTube about the new Justice League action figures coming out the new 52 ones so I got the uh, Batman this thing is really cool um, it was sculpted very nicely. It's uh, for nineteen dollars. You can't beat the price on that. It's a really neat um, action figure. It's sculpted by Jack Matthews, and uh, it's really cool because it's the first action figure that features Jim Lee's new outfit for Batman. So, yeah, it might be might be a collectible one day. So it's going to go in my cabinet with all the rest of my little statues and stuff. And um, next one's coming out. It's going to be Aquaman. So Dennis, uh, I know you're going to be excited about that. And uh, I'll probably pick up Aquaman, Aquaman uh, just for you, <laughs> and Green Lantern. So uh, that's the next two that are coming out in June. So uh, yeah, definitely get those. They're really cool. And uh, now to my eBay items I picked up. I've been trying to get a uh, Walt Simonson autographed Thor comic because he's my favorite um, uh, author and. Uh, artists and I uh, found the guy that was selling a bunch that uh, had COAs and everything and I got them for like three bucks a piece so uh, I got issue 339 signed by Walt Simonson down here it's really cool because Beta Ray Bill is my second favorite character so I was excited to get it on one of those um, and I also got issue 340 signed at the bottom down here so uh, yeah I'm really excited to have those plus I got a trade coming soon um, that I did, I'll do a video of that whenever I get it. Uh, it's going to be issue 337 of, uh, signed by Walt Simonson. So, um, be looking for that pretty soon. And, um, that's it for now. I'll do another video again. Thanks again, Gary. Please, everybody subscribe to his channel. I'll put a link below in the, uh, subscription, uh, description box. And, uh, y'all have a safe weekend and take care. I'll talk to you later.